Have you ever wondered about the difference between planning permission and building regulations approval? It can seem confusing and annoying. You've been given planning permission and now you're told that you need to apply for another document before you can build anything. Why is that? And why are planning permission and building regulations approval two different things? We'll start with planning permission, which is the more complicated one. Planning permission is about making sure that the right kind of buildings are built in the right places. Planning permission will deal with the appearance of your building and what you're intending to use it for. It will take into account whether what you're proposing deprives your neighbours of light or privacy. Also takes into account traffic and public transport access. For big developments, planning permission can depend on whether there are enough school places or GP capacity locally. That's why your planning application shouldn't just be a set of architectural drawings. You should also submit an evidence-packed design and access statement. Planning applications are looked at by your local council, and in most cases, they have eight weeks to make a decision. You need building regulations approval, meanwhile, to show that whatever you're going to have built, rebuilt or refurbished is going to be safe, sustainable and accessible. There are lots of things you can do to your home or buildings you own without planning permission, but anything more than basic repairs will need building regulations approval. For major works, you'll need a structural engineer along with your architect to prepare your application. You can get approval from the council's building control department, or you can hire a private inspector. For smaller projects, you can submit a building notice notification instead of full plans to speed things up. But that does bring the risk of having your works grind to a halt if the inspector doesn't think you're correctly complying with the regulations when they visit the site. So now you should have a clear idea of what both these crucial documents are and why you'll need building regulations approval to go with your planning permission before you can start construction. Subscribe to see more from us. Follow us on social media or get in touch via urbanistarchitecture.co.uk